everyone how are you all thank you for joining me in studio this evening studio three i hope you're all well i hope you're having a lovely day thank you so much for taking the time to come to studio today it's been a fabulous fabulous day did you just catch helen over on creating craft at six o'clock wasn't she good she's so good i can't tell you she's really good she really does the brand proud uh, Helen if you are wa watching thank you so much because obviously today I couldn't get to create and craft because of our brand event and I can't be in two places at once but I will pick up the shows tomorrow so I'm up at 5am in the morning and off to trot to create and craft to pick up the shows and sell whatever Helen has left for me it makes a change isn't it me going and following Helen than Helen following me I will do a shout out but just a little bit of admin so don't forget to click that subscribe button it's lovely for you all to come and say hello if you are tuning in for the first time where have you been studio three studio one studio two we just have big smiles on our faces and it's just lovely for you all to come and say hello and get some inspiration so click that subscribe button we have had our brand event today and it's been amazing hasn't it just have you all did you all enjoy the shows let me know did you all enjoy the shows it's a long day i tell you it's a long day but every time we switch the camera on for the next brand i'm energized again because of their product because of their demos it's just an amazing day so we've had four shows today in the how to craft network and tonight you've got me again so you've got me over about 13 hours over the weekend 13 hours you lot will be sick of me <laughs> let's do a shout out you will be sick of me you're saying you won't but i promise you absolutely will be sick of me so let's do it it's it's moving quite fast so i'll try my best to pick up um all the names i can don't forget though if you have a question type q q q and i will um and i will continue to answer any questions let me just make sure i've turned that uh, music right down hopefully it's gone now for you there we go so there we go no music now hopefully fingers crossed so there we go um we shouldn't have any interruptions tonight so it's going to be a good show i'm feeling energized great shows isn't it good yes it's been good so did you all get the products that you liked got some goodies got some new products to play with um we will be sending them out monday we didn't send them out today and i told the girls to hold off because i felt like you couldn't really watch another show without wanting something from each show so and i wanted you to be able to combine the postage all in one so they'll all go on monday let's do a shout out what's the weather like what are we all having for our tea it's seven o'clock on a friday night so let's see hi hi annette anita and she watched helen over on create and craft hi shirley hi tracy hi marilyn hi roxy lee hi glynis hi tracy hi amanda uh, hi Wendy, Elizabeth, Shirley, Karen, Marilyn, Christine, Joanne. Guess what? I've got to announce the giveaways as well from the Teresa Collins show. I have the names written down somewhere. I was organised. I was organised. You can see me. I, this looks like a posh glass, like I'm drinking posh. It's just water. <laughs> I need something stiff in here tonight, though. I really do. So, um, is Henry joining us tonight, Karen? I hope not. <laughs> I hope not. Let me just move this out of the way. So, Joe, Christine, Tracy, oh, it's lovely for you all to come and say hello. Seven o'clock Friday night. What have I got to tell you about? Don't forget to go back and watch the shows from today. Really inspiring, guys. The uh, the brands did stamped by me proud again today. Uh, in this evening's show, we're going to do a little bit of a demonstration following the theme of our memory album book, our tag album book. We're going to do a pocket page book with a little bit of a sort of closure element on it tonight so all of the things that i'm showing you in studio three you can combine into one big project i'm just sh showing you little snippets and bits and pieces of album type style things and then you can take it away and combine it if you want to or use them as enterprises on their own equally beautiful as an individual if you want to or together I can't wait to see what you're all going to do you all love the envelope you all love the tag you've all gone back and watched it and done it as well so let's have a look on our usa fan page and then we'll have a look on stamped by me as well so we have hi Jeannie quinn you've been with us all day sweetheart thank you so much uh signal is poor today and it's windy oh maybe you'll be able to watch on catch up so we have brenda 
um, Danucci as well at uh, Uni Quinn, and then we have um, Carol, Marilyn, Tanya. Ooh, exciting! So I have some. Just had sweet and sour chicken. Oh, do you have to sweet and sour chicken? I'm a little bit hungry myself, actually. Now you said that has made me feel hungry. So let's have a quick um, talk through. Shall we do? Let's do some new products I want to show you. Now you can't buy them. I don't do pre-order. Um, you can't buy them, but you can click the notify me when in stock to make sure I know I've ordered enough. So the two products that I'm going to show you, um, if you like them, go and click the notify me when in stock on our website. And it's some sparkle pens, but sparkle pens with a totally, totally new concept, to totally different. And I don't think I've ever seen any like this before, she says, hopefully. You'll probably see them in weeks to come because people copy and that's absolutely fine. However, let me just show you how amazing these are. So... Let's just grab some cardstock. I have the names of the winners too. I'm going to move it out of the way because you're probably going to see that when I'm pressing the buttons and things like that. <laughs> so I'm going to grab some white cardstock and some white cardstock. So now to explain, let me just grab one of our regular sparkle pens. So these were our regular sparkle pens in a whole bunch of colours. We did lots, if you remember. So Gossip, Sparkle Pens, Ink Worth Talking About. And they were the coloured ones. Um, so they've got like a coloured ink and then this, the glitter is added. So let me just show you what exactly what I mean. So let's just go on overhead here very quickly. So this is the pink or coral it comes out a little bit more like. So let me just pop some on here. So you can see the ink is coloured. We we'll see this here. Just get an over a lay down there. So when they dry, they're super sparkly. Let me just grab another colour as well, so you can see how delicious they are. So these were the coloured ones, and we've we've been doing these for about three years, as you all know. Most of you probably will have them. So I'm, the reason I'm showing you these is because I want to show you how different our new ones are. Okay, so you can see the sparkle in there there we go if i tilt it that way there we go towards the light you can see the sparkle so these are encapsulated in a colored ink okay so you will all know as well we did a clear overlay pen i'm just grabbing it now just trying to find it which one was it where are you is it this one just one second here we go so you'll all know we did the clear overlay didn't we where it comes it's totally clear so you can't see but it gives like that lovely sparkly finish. You can just see it just there. Can we see that there? So you'll remember we did this one as well, which is just the clear. Let's get some real down. Let me get, give it a good old squeeze. Let's get some color through. I think mine's nearly empty, you know. Come on, give me some color just for this demo. Thank you. So you can see that. There. there we go. So it's like a clear um, ink. Well, our ink can't be clear, but it's encapsulated in a clear formula. And then all that's left is the, is the sparkle. Now, this is the best selling one. It works on overlays on flowers and all of the good stuff. I use this more often than not. But equally, you can put the colour down and drag it out with a clear and get a beautiful sort of wash in your colours and things like that. But what I'm going to show you today is completely different. So let's just set these aside very quickly. So now we have our clear overlay pens with colored sparkle so we've turned it um we've turned it from colored ink to a light glitter to a clear ink and a colored glitter so what does that mean it means so much so now we can do a clear overlay so instead of the silver sparkle that you traditionally get we can get pink just sparkly glitter we can get blue just sparkly glitter we can get gold now i have seen gold overlay and i have seen a silver overlay but i've never seen colored ones wait till i show you they're so cool so you could put that clear overlay over your colored images and you'll have a pink sparkle and it's the not the ink that's sparkling it's the colored glitter that's sparkling they are so yummy oh my so we have two sets set one and set two they're on the website gossip you'll see it says new and exclusive it's just under this live video on my website now click notify me you might like both you might like one um, but just let me know so first of all let me show you set one now you'll notice they all have a clear ring 
but they are all named okay so let me show you let's give them a shake so exciting so exciting glitter pens oh my gosh so let's just move this one out of the way here and let's just bring in i'm going to do them on white and i'm going to do them on black and that's what you're going to see so let's just put this down here so i have set one here set one and in set one the colors are blush yale and shamrock so let's go for it shall we give them a good old shake tony are you ready for these They're just amazing so tonight i'm showing you some bra these brand new sparkle pens but tomorrow night i don't know if did how many of you just watched helen an hour ago how many of you watched did you see she pulled out an electronic eraser yes you did if you did so tomorrow i'm going to show you some new tools which are about to land any day and again i'm going to pop them on i might pop them on the web notifier it's a bit late now because i've ordered them so but i'm going to show you them tomorrow so you can have a nose so you need to come back tomorrow night at seven o'clock right let's do this one let's go on to overhead oh you've just now now you can see there so let's show you on here so totally clear look so you can you can see where this is going on your flowers can't you totally clear i'll let that dry i'm not going to hold it up to the camera but this is where you're going to see the color glitter watch this now i'll hold just give it a second so this is blush i'm hoping please there we go i'm hoping you can see it please just give me the nod if you can so you'll see the blush so it's clear with a blush color in there hopefully you'll see that can we see that there give me a shout out guys let me know hello sandy sandy's watching from illinois in the us lovely for you to come and say hi sweetheart these are our new gossip sparkle pens but they're not like an everyday sparkle pen these are totally different they're encapsulated in a clear um liquid and it's the sparkle that is the color so normally you will see traditionally the inks are in a colored ink like so on my cardstock here which we've been doing successfully for about three years whereas these ones are in a clear ink and the color is the glitter so that's blush so this is set one give the second one a, a twist so let's do this one here so you can see it's it goes on absolutely clear can we see that so you're going to get those lovely overlays so let's put that on there and let's show you on the black it's the black i think where you can really all see where it's going so this one is shamrock this is in set one so let's give it a ch i'll hold it up for you here can we see there can we see hopefully you can see better than i can see you'll have to let me i can see it tony yes we can see it looks gorgeous glittery goodness need can we see there so this one is shamrock and look at it on the black i mean come on and the more they dry the sparklier they get i have to let me know i have have um have you seen anything like this before i did do my research and i'm usually quite good I have seen silvery ones and I have seen goldy ones, but I've never seen these sort of beautiful, beautiful um, coloured ones. And then the last one in here is called Yale. So let's get the colour down. And I'll pick it up in a second so you can see the colour and then we'll... There is certainly a wow on black, but you still get that beautiful iridescent sparkle color on your flowers it's just it's just amazing because normally we all go for our clear sparkle we've done it for years haven't we how cool is it now to be able to add a clear sparkle on top of our flowers that's got colored sparkling amazing so can we see here look at that so this one is yale and it's like a deep navy and then here we go on the black i'm hoping you can see that ladies and gents you'll have to let me know 
leave a little bit of sparkle everywhere you go justine says amazing aren't they cool so this is set one they're on the website click the notify me because i think i'm gonna have to order a few more i didn't know you know i didn't know if you know because of the colored inks we didn't we don't use the colored inks as much as we use the clear the, the clear ink and as as much as i know how much i put my hands on the clear ink i didn't know if you guys would love um colored sparkle encapsulated in a clear but as i've used them and used them and used them thought how can you not just amazing how can you not <laughs> so excited electric blue is stunning so I'll, what i'll do is i'll just set these two aside so this is set one remember and in set one we've got shamrock yale and blush so i'll just move that up there for now out of the way let's get the second set so black and a piece of white here we go and let me just turn my card over so this is where you're gonna just have so much fun here let me just show you so give it a swirl so this is set two so again, as it dry, you know, it disperses. So I'll do it on there and then, are you ready? So this one is called 24K. so gorgeous on black you're going to love this this is going to be sparkle on all of your projects but to be able to do it on black like this wow factor for me so next one so that was 24k this one is eggplant So this is a purple tone, hopefully. Let's just let it dry just a little bit. Purple tone. Oh, just give me your bank details, Shaz. Oh, I'm sorry. And they were all... I did only bring two out. There was opportunity to bring like five or six out. But I just decided, no, just stick with the two, Tony. And then the last one is called Pebble. So this is literally so subtle. Come on. Just get on a second. Let me just give this a good old shake. Shake it to wake it. Just giving it a good old shake. <laughs> Do lovely splats, absolutely. So try it out. Here we go. There we go. So this is like a subtle. And this one's pebble. So it's got a grey, steely undertone. Oh, put your finger in its own. See that there? So this is set two. What do we think? very sparkly yeah do you like those so they're coming pretty much imminently but if you do like them don't forget to click the notify me when in stock that just gives me a heads up of how many i want to try and get everybody to get into the habit of clicking the notify me when in stock because as you know ordering is quite difficult at the moment what do people like there are so many brands so many companies and do i want a warehouse full of stock absolutely not but do i want enough so everybody gets what they want absolutely i do so stunning love 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 so set one and set two set one you have blush yale and shamrock and in set two we have eggplant 24k and pebble so there we go something new i'll show you something brand new tomorrow night as well at seven o'clock so shall we do a bit of crafting now you've all seen the sparkle i have the winners of the Teresa collins products as well so let's just see if there's any questions have we got any questions 
gorgeous beautiful love them purple and gold your favorite yeah which one's your favorite color very sparkly eggplant for you Shirley I'm sorry I'm Shirley likes purple maybe love 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 it on the black I know you can just uh, heat emboss an image and color them in on the black and the reflection is just going to catch that sparkle isn't it as you twist and go with them they are fab thank you so much something a little bit different trying to stay ahead of the curve doesn't happen all the time but I try so let's um, do a bit of crafting so what I wanted to show you this evening was going back to the album sort of um, idea I know I'm, I've only used time to grow paper since I've been in studio three but because people bought them and we have that QR code all the videos will get loaded on so you'll be able to go back and watch the inspiration so I do try and use them a couple of times at the very least so you all have got a great QR code to go back and um, watch so let's have a look what I've got on my desk so I have a piece of A4 scored down the middle and I, scored, I didn't quite score it in the middle so I took, trimmed a little bit off the edge here but I'm going to show you how to me maybe make a little bit of a wallet type style design or if you want to call it an interactive card you can absolutely do that so i've just cut one piece ahead of time and this is going to be my front cover can we see here like so so our book is instantly coming together straight away before we've even started now i am using the eight by eights because i only get a small amount of off cut from it which i like so i'm just going to go in and find let's do this one some pieces that I like and I'm just going to trim them down super easy super super easy so I'm just using my little cutter here I'm just been and clicked thank you everyone that's super kind so I'm just going to measure this one because I've already cut this one to size and I'll just pop a little fingernail mark up here look and then we'll just trim this one down and then we'll just cut a few up I need four so let's go ahead and cut four blue and green for me oh you're all gonna have your favorites aren't you it's hopefully the colors that you like are in the same set so you only have to buy one but if I know you all well you're all probably gonna buy both anyway so we're just crafters aren't we that's what we do but um, yeah if you just like one then just get the one red and green for Christmas absolutely Amanda so let's just move this out of the way so I'm just going to pop this on here instead of marking again pop a little finger mark on here pop this down so I know that you all because you've some of you have taken some time to message me about these albums and things which has been lovely and I know for some reason you're all just absolutely loving this sort of mini album con concept -y idea so but I am going to chop it up a little bit. Studio will not always be mini albums as much as I love it. Um, it won't always be mini albums. We will do other things as well. Things that we probably wouldn't be able to do normally in an everyday studio. Because studio one and two is, yes, we do inspiration. Yes, we do the Create Together Club and things like that. But we do have to try and sell product too. Because that's the whole purpose of the show. So this is more you know just a little bit more relaxed you can ask questions we can be creative we can craft off the cuff as well which is something i don't normally do either so let's put this to one side and let's just grab my glue very quickly here we go let's have a look where do you click so if you go to the product leslie which is on the website it might be underneath here or just put gossip in the search engine and then the, the two most recent ones that come up um set one and two it says new and exclusive just click the notify me when back in stock and then you'll get notified when it does come in stock and if you're still interested you can buy it and if not you just delete the email it's done right let's get back to crafting yep set two is listed first then set one next to it perfect thank you so let's bring in our card so this is just a piece of white cards 250 gsm again going back to what i said before about utilizing what you have in your stash we don't need anything special to create fabulous gifts for our loved ones and we will all have papers and card stock in our stash so what we need to do is we need to get our front cover on here so let's stick this down first Get it 
stay as straight as you possibly can. Give it a good push down. It is lovely to use the papers instead of looking at them, Jeannie. So that's the front. Shall we do the middle? So shall we go? Let's go these two inside, hey, because they're quite light in colour. Well done, Leslie. Oh, I did want to um, tell you all as well. I've been telling you all the 29th for our WOW show with Marion. It's not actually the 29th, it's the 26th. Sorry for the confusion. I've asked you all to save the date. You'll all be say, wondering what's happening on the 29th. It's the 26th, my apologies. So if you are saving the day and wanting to watch Marion and all of her techniques, the date is actually the 26th. We will be popping it in a newsletter as well, but sorry, I did confuse you all there. I did say it was the 29th, but it's the 26th. And then we can do... I think I'm going to pop that up there simply because I think I'm going to put a pocket on here. So I don't want to hide that beautiful rose. Yeah, it's new gossip, Sue. Why do we call it gossip? Does anybody know? I'll show the colours that the, if you've just joined us, I'll not go through, I'll not do them all swatch again, but I'll show you the swatches I made. They're just um, a different way of using sparkle pens now, so really, really cool. So as you can see here, we've got the centre of our book. And then the offcuts from the pages I will decorate, but I just want to show you something here. So when you turn your card over, I want to show you like a, maybe a posh closure. Ink worth talking about. Thank you so much, Marion. Margaret, sorry. Ink worth talking about. Well done, guys. So what I want to do here is I want to do a posh closure on my little book. Or So if you wanted to do like a family photo and a family photo, you could absolutely do that. You can do pockets and things. We've spoken about this over the course of however many shows here in Studio 3. But what I want to show you now is maybe a different way to do closures. So if you wanted to do a ribbon closure, you'd tape the ribbon down now and then you'd hide the ugly makings by popping your card on the top and you'd do that on the back side and the front side and then tie it in a bow at the side, which is, you know, pretty straightforward. But you can also do magnets as well. So you'll tape this down pop a magnet on the back of here and then on the front and it'll shut close you. it'll have a magnetic closure and then you put your card on and you hide your ugly makings underneath but today we're going to do like an old wallet closure so this is just to show you how you can chop it up and make different closures rather than just having it as a sort of open and close here so let me just show you what I'm thinking so I'm just going to grab the piece of card no I don't want that one because it's clashing no nope. let's go this one look I like that texture so think about how far you want it into your book and I'm going to go a little bit further because I want it to look like an oldie worldy journal. So I'm just going to take that and I'm just going to sort of twist it round the back like so. And then I can see I've got that sort of crease line in there. Can we see that there? And then on the back here, I'm just going to glue it down. I'll give it a second to grab. Make sure it's absolutely straight on the front. I'm happy with it. Now, I did take my corner punch home with me, and I'm a bit sad about that. Um, so my corner punch is at home. But if you have your corner punch, um, you can corner punch the edges and make it look pretty if you want to. Ink worth talking about. Everybody knows now. <laughs> Everything's called gossip. So there we go. So you get on the back here, and then you grab your... Um, piece here and look it hides that ugly making so this is all born out of a piece of a4 white card you all have this in your stash now think about um christmas wallets i know it's a long way away but we will be launching christmas in june um christmas wallets birthday wallets what about a graduation photo what about a prom photo what about a picture of your grandson or your grandchild or something like that 
so inexpensive. Use the colour themes, use your washi tapes. So much you can do. Jeannie, ink worth talking about. Well done, sweetheart. You all know now. <laughs> Give it a good old push down. Now, I didn't really quite put enough glue on there, I don't think, but I can think you can see where it's going. So already we have something that looks quite pretty. Already, look at that. Okay, but what I want to do is I want to create like, you know, a tucking, you know, like an old journal tucking. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to take, um, let's just set that aside. I'm just going to take some of the lovely sort of blue that we have left. I'm just going to create like a little miniature clasp on my project here. So I'm going to go, and there are no rules, there's no measurements, you don't have to um, stick to guides and things like that. I'm just going to go maybe here, make sure it's absolutely straight. Like so. So I have a strip here, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my score tool, so I'll get rid of the pink one and bring in the white one. And I'm just going to put a score line in here and I'll show you why in a second. So I've got that score line in there. And this is going to create like a little bit of a hump on my project. And I'll show you exactly where this is going. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create like one of those clasps. So I'm going to stick that there and then I'm going to go to here. I'm just going to pop a little bit of a score line here as well. And that's just simply, so when we come to put our card stock up, tuck our sort of um, side panel in, it just gives us a little bit of movement on the band. So it won't put it under stress, if that makes any sense. So if you have, um, and then cut it off the end. If you have um, magnets and things like that, of course you can use those, but I wanted to show you just an alternative way, because like I say, I don't want you to have to go out and buy product. Hopefully you'll be able to create something from what you have in your stash. So I would corner around these, but can you see having that like little bit of a hinge clasp sort of design on there? How cool that's gonna look. So, and then what you can do is you just pull it out and then we push it back in. We see that there? So let's glue it. Where should we glue? We go here, let's go here. So I'm just gonna hold that in place, lift this up Pop some, sorry I'm in shot. Pop some glue there. Hold that down. And then lift this one up. Oops much glue on there Tony. <laughs> so creative thank you it's, I'm not I'm not teaching you anything that you don't already know probably some of you but it's just looking at your projects in a different way so you know we don't have to go out and buy all the bits and bobs I suppose and giftables you know, just look incredible, don't they? Now, the other things that you could also do is if you've got brads, you could make it look like leather. If you've got leather style papers and things like that. So you could really be creative with the design. So then all you do, um, it's not glued yet, so I'm not going to take it out. Just give it a second to grab on there. Get rid of any glue. I'll wait till that's absolutely stuck before I pull that out. And then all I'm going to do is I'm going to take these panels here and maybe do two side pockets. So we can put family photos underneath both sides. So when the person that you give it to opens it up, it has some beautiful photos inside. We spoke about seed packets. We spoke about all the, th the giftables that you can abs excuse me, absolutely do um, with these inexpensive tag albums, envelope albums. I mean, come on, you could, you've got, you've probably got a whole bunch of them sat on your side at home, haven't you? 
you all have you're all nodding at me at the telly you are so i do have a giveaway so um have you seen a share button i forgot to mention this it's a bit late now because the show's nearly over but still all the same if you do see a share button if you can click the share button that would be appreciated so let me show you here look so i've just pulled it out there it was fine and then we can tuck it back in and it just sticks straight under so if you've got a fancy edge punch maybe or if you want to leave it square maybe distress it with your scissors and things like that you can absolutely do that so let's have a look at the inside of our book so here i'm going to create two side pockets on my design here can we see this here so sort of like it matches real oh, what a shame no i'll do a pocket at the base on this one because i don't want to hide that it's too pretty isn't it so all i'm going to do is i'm just going to take this lovely piece here and again glue down the side glue's running out it's either all or nothing isn't it so glue down the top down the side and along the base looks great Jeannie says thanks Jeannie That's super kind try and get it level if you can So we have that little extra pocket there. Already shared. Thank you so much, everyone. And then across the base here, I'm just going to finger mark where I need to cut it. And we'll trim it off in our guillotine. And then all of the good stuff that comes with, not this one, this one. All of the good stuff that comes with um, decorating your album as well, i.e. picture, uh, sorry, embellishments, photo, the flowers, 3D, some flowers on top. All I would say is if you are putting quite some something quite substantial in the middle of the book, maybe think about giving your book a, a, a little bit of a hinge or a gusset. So score, maybe leave half a centimetre and score again. And then if you are putting packets of sweets in and things like that, it's not going to look ugly when you come to shut it because you've popped that little bit of um, uh, sort of depth to the book. I'll end up with a full wedding collection with all books I've been making lately, won't we? <laughs> and then you can absolutely just pretend these are photos or gifts and you can pop them in and just be really, really bookmarks. Be really, really creative with what you're popping in for that extra special person. And then when you come to shut it, now you could do a magnet, magnet on here and a magnet underneath this piece of paper so it'll snap shut if you've got magnets. But I just think this is an absolutely quirky way of sealing a beautiful, beautiful album. What do y'all think? Do we like that? Are we going to try it? Are we going to try it? You'll have to let me know. So that is the end of the show. I will show you some swatches again of the sparkle pens and then I'll announce the winners for the Teresa Collins goodies. But I have a giveaway. Thank you for sharing. But to be in with a chance to win a £20 voucher for Stamps by Me, I felt like I'd missed out today because everybody else on their shows, I gave a £20 voucher away to anybody who answered a question. So you need to go back and watch those videos because I ask a question in everybody's show and you just need to pop the answer underneath and I'm going to give one winner from each show so one from Emma's show, one from Simon's show, one from Sarah's show, and one from Sandra's show, and now one from my show, if you pop the answer to the question underneath. So the question here to you is, can you name two of the colours that I'm launching in the new sparkle pens? Pop it underneath this video when we've gone off air. So two of the colour names pop underneath this video, and I'm going to announce some more winners over the course of the weekend. So let me just show you, first of all, these colour swatches. So we have the this white one. Let me show you, because it's... Oh, I don't know what's happened there. Let's just have a look. My screen's just gone off. My screen's just gone off. Oh, here we are. There we go. So let's just show you the white ones very quickly. So these are on white cardstock. 
So here we have, let me give you the names very quickly. I don't want to bore you all again. So this is, oh, which ones did, oh, this is the second set. So we have eggplant, 24 carat and pebble. So clear, but the, it's the glitter that's coloured, encapsulated in a clear. And then we have them on the black. So this is set two. Oh, I'm giving you the names. Oh, Tony, what are you doing? I'm giving you the names. Stop right now. I'm not telling you the names of this one. And here are your set ones. So just twist them in the colour. There we go. Look at those beauties. So all you need to do is pop a comment underneath this video of the colour names of the um, pens. And I will give you a £20 voucher. Now, I have some giveaways. Teresa did announce in studio, if you remember, that she wanted five winners from her live studio to win some products. And she popped up a whole bunch of different bits and pieces. So just quick to show you here. So she left me a handful of lots of different bits and pieces. You might get something different, but it'll definitely be a whole bunch of goodies from Teresa. So this one's got some pin badges. We've got a pencil case. We have some stickers and we have a beautiful tote bag, which is printed on both sides. And it says, be you. So I have five winners from the Teresa Collins show. Thank you so much. If you did comment, those five winners are, are you ready? We have Angela Vaines. Well done, sweetheart. All you need to do is go to info at stamps by me with your address if you want to, or you can personal message me on our Facebook pages. So we have Angela Vaines. Thank you so much. Well done. We have Sarah Burr. Well done, sweetheart. We have Tan McGuinness. We have Sharon Hudson. And we have Leslie Scott. So those are your five winners for some goodies from Teresa Collins. And that's just to say thank you so much for tuning in for our live event. She did come all the way from the USA to do a How to Craft Network studio with us. So she wanted to give some lovely products away. The books are on the way. They'll land any day. So notify me when back in stock for the book as well. I hope you've enjoyed this evening's show. The demo is quite um, short. I do apologise, but I'm up at 5 a.m. in the morning. So and I will do that giveaway if you want to come and pop an answer underneath there as well. So I'm just going to say goodbye for now. And don't forget to go back and watch all of the other videos as well, because today has been absolutely amazing. Whatever you're doing, have a great evening. Don't forget to pop a comment underneath. Stay safe. I'll see you all on Create and Craft tomorrow, 10 a.m. See you all there. Bye.